This video uh, demonstrate how to install staple OpenStack Havana in Ubuntu uh, using DevStack. Okay, so I am going to install this OpenStack Havana in a virtual machine. So you can if you are if you are installed uh, Ubuntu in your laptop, you can install OpenStack there or you can create a virtual machine and install Ubuntu there and you can install then you can install OpenStack there so I am using Ubuntu I will show you the Ubuntu 30.10 13.10 this is 64 bit ok uh, so let me find the IP of this virtual machine so it's once 56.10 let me log in there so I can copy paste 192.168.56.109 okay, I can copy paste a command here so it is it will be difficult to uh, paste command inside a virtual machine so let me log SSH to the virtual machine okay right now I am inside that virtual machine so let me create a one folder there open stack then go to that folder so here I am going to clone the dev stack from the github so you can so this is the location of dev stack in the in this github so you, you you will get the link from here the uh, download link so if you go here you can see the branches so i am going to check out this particular branch stable however if you want to install grizzly you can check out this branch or you can try master also so i am going to check out the Havana branch so that will install Havana ok so this is the command so you can see git clone let me copy this thing paste here you can see git clone then the repository path then the name of the branch stable Havana so check out that Okay, it's done okay so that you can see a one folder named dev stack go to that folder so inside that you can see the dev stack files so let me check the branch so here you can see it's stable Havana okay so after that You have to put these things inside the local RC file. So right now, so if you see here, there is no local RC file. You can create one and put your credentials there. Credentials for database, rabbit, MQ, service token, then service password, admin password. So 
so you don't have to create actually you don't have to create this local rc file if you run stack dot stack dot slash stack it will ask for the password so let me go that way i will i am not going to create the local rc file i am directly i am going to run directly that stack script here we can see the star where is the stack script here i am going to run this stack.sh file okay see this is asking for the password enter a password now password for database so i am going to under open stack so let me type password password so this password for rabbit mq password. service token password so i'm just giving password password okay so after that the actual process start so this will take a couple of minutes that process is going on so if you go to that VM to shift cd slash opt if you go to that slash opt you can see a stack folder so actually all these packages are installing there inside that stack slash opt stack folder if you go there you can see the folder so it's, it's right now it's just installing those installing the packages so so I, let me update this thing so you can see the files so it start start cloning things so if you go to here if i think now you can see the files. So, so it started the cloning so it's cloning the project one by openstack project from the github Oslo messaging so that is a thing you can see here Oslo messaging is cloning the projects okay please wait uh, I think it will take time Okay, uh, installation completed. Okay, let me so you can see that it's cloned a lot of OpenStack projects here. So 
let me open the dashboard just wait it will take i think it will take time okay let me open it here so 192.168.56.101 so you are getting error forbidden you don't have permission to access so you have to fix that issue what you have to do is you have to edit on configuration file apache configuration file you don't have permission to access slash on this server so just run edit this file okay then here we need to add this required require our grant start that here and save then then uh, restart apache okay then let me try it again go to slash of pt stack okay it's coming you can log in using crash admin then password is password okay it's working so this is uh, stable open stack havana so how uh, how we can confirm that we are uh, installed the stable uh, version of OpenStack Havana. So we can do one thing. We can go to one of this thing. We can go one of these project. For example, Horizon. Then run its branch. So there we can see stable Havana. So arise. We are using the stable uh, Havana branch of Horizon. If you go to any of these project and check, uh, if you run git branch, you will see the, the same thing. So let me check the keystone. Sorry. Keystone and run git branch. So we can see stable Havana. Let me go to Nova. run stable branch you can see stable Havana so all these projects are um, for all these projects we clone the stable Havana branch okay so I will show one more thing if you want to see let me go to CD open stack dev step folder there, there is a couple of other scripts are there for example rejoin stack and unstack so if you want to stop all those all these services you can all uh, run dot slash and stack that will stop all open stack services like keystone nova so it's uh, it's also it's stopping Apache 2 so it stopped all services so after that if you go to this horizon you will get error because it stopped the Apache and all other OpenStack services so if you want to restart 
you are, can use this script rejoin stack dot sh so that will start all services again so right now you are seeing the screen session so here in the, in the bottom side you can see the name of the open stack services which are running so you can switch to the and if you press control a n control a n you using that key you can switch to next window so yeah right now we are seeing the here you can see key we means keystone the log log of the keystone service if you press control a n it will go to nest so this is the log of the horizon here you can see horizon service then control a n this r reg i don't know what is that so like there is a lot of other services are there you can see the log of oh, each service so you can use control a then double quotes so you can see the how many screen screens are open uh, screens are there in this screen session your volume then thing is this n or nova services this is service start with n these are nova related this is cinder i think cinder scheduler cinder api cinder volume okay so if you want to exit from this window you can use the key control a then b so you can exit i told you i think uh, this rejoin stack will start the start, start all services again so let me try to open this window again uh, this horizon again sorry it's not working Start this Apache. Okay, that will come. Okay, it's working. So, so this way you can install st um, stable version of OpenStack Havana using double stack script okay bye